What's up, YouTube? It's your girl, Danny. I know I have not been on here for a while. I also know that the last video that I did, I said the exact same thing in the beginning of this video, that I, was, I have not been on here for a while. I sincerely apologize for that. It's just been a lot that's been going on, and it's been increasingly hard to come on here and do a video. So now that school is out for my kids, it's summertime, I have a little bit more time on my hands. So I wanted to come and update you all and let you know what to look forward to on my channel from here on out, okay? First things first, uh, my hair regimen. I know I've discussed this before, but since my hair has gotten longer, it's sort of changed. And I also exercise seven days a week, so it's also changed because of that. So instead of you sit, instead of sitting here and describing to you deti detail by detail what my hair regimen is, I'm going to upload a series of videos. It's gonna be like a week in the hair life of Danny. And I'm going to start with my deep condition day, which is a Wednesday, and then take you throughout my week to show you how I style and restyle my hair and how I maintain my hair throughout the week all the way up until Tuesday until it's time for me to, you know, deep condition again the very next day. So you can get an idea of what it looks like and what I've been going through for the past couple of months or so that you have not been able to watch me on YouTube, okay? Speaking of which... I have also started blogging, so in between time when I can't record a video, you can also catch my hair updates on my new blog, which is dannymylove.wordpress.com, and I will post that in the bottom bar so you would um, be able to, you know, click that and check that out as well. I'm going to be discussing not only my hair journey from here on out, but also my daughter's hair um, and the new regimen I've put in place for them to retain their length and to keep their hair moisturized and everything. I'll also discuss a little bit of fashion, a little bit of makeup because that's other stuff that I've also taken interest in that I've you know, gotten into. And um, I may even throw a couple of things about my weight loss in there as well. Now, my weight loss. I have been on a weight loss journey since March. Um, it was actually the week of my birthday which was March 21st so it started like March 19th or so. Um, I started off at 150 pounds. This is June 19th today and I am now 135 pounds and I've actually maintained that weight for about a month now. So it's just about like May 20th I believe is when I hit that 135 mark. So I've maintained that 15 pound weight loss and now I'm working on the toning portion, portion of my journey. Um, most of that inspiration and that encouragement came from my girl on here, Miss V. Charles. She started her weight loss journey back in January of this year, and she's now six months into the game. And I'm going to tell you guys, her body's looking nice. If you are not subscribed to her, check her channel out. I'm going to post her information on there as well. And see the changes her body has been going through. It is, like, so awesome. She is such an inspiration. So I want to shout her out because she also shouted me out in one of her videos. My mouth dropped when I saw that. <laughs> So I was happy to see that and keep doing what you do, girl, because you are looking nice, okay? Um, also on my channel, uh, my, me and my best friend have decided that we wanted to do like a curl friend series where she comes on as a guest. We'll probably do this like once a month and we'll discuss natural hair and fashion and makeup and dating and all kinds of other random, randomness. And she may also uh, style my hair on camera, and I'm going to attempt to style hers. And I say attempt only because I am not a hairstylist by any means, but, you know, we try to keep things even. So she's also the one that did my sew-in, and she also did my kinky twist back when I big chopped. Um, I believe it was like when I big chopped in October, and I believe she did my kinky twist sometime in November of that year or so. So that's the hairstylist in the game here, not me, but she wants me to do her hair on camera. We'll see how that works out, okay? Um, this is June, and June marks my two-year post-relaxer anniversary. Yay! Right? Okay, so two years ago, June 2010 was my last relaxer, and then October 2010 is when I did my big chop. So I want to take this time to encourage any of my subscribers that are either transitioning uh, or thinking about transitioning, 
they, they big chop or they're thinking about doing the big chop or whatever stage in your journey that you're in now. I want to encourage you to keep going with it and, and stay in it because this journey has went by so fast. Like two years got here like that. I was looking at my videos the other day and I was like, man, like I was really bald headed back then. Like if you go to like my first video that I recorded, not the hair journey video, not the slideshow, but the one right after that, I was bald headed compared to what I have now. Okay. So that time flies so fast. To my big choppers out here that have just done it, enjoy it. Enjoy this moment where you only have one to two to three to four inches of hair on your head. Because I really, really, really miss those days where I just got up and I hopped in the shower and I wet my hair through a little leave-in conditioner on it and was out the door. I miss those days. I still kind of do that now, but now my hair requires a little bit more sectioning and detangling and removing shed hairs and pre-pooing and de -pooing and it's stressful. Not saying that I don't like it because I don't want to wake up tomorrow ball, you know, all bald head, Lord. I'm, I'm not saying that I don't appreciate the hair that I have on my head because I do. But I want my big choppers out there to I know you longing for long hair, but enjoy this moment, I am telling you, because it is just so easy. This is the most simplest part of your hair journey. When your hair starts to grow out and you get to be in a year and almost two years later like I am, your, when your arms get to hurting, when you're detangling and putting twists in and, and all that other craziness, you're going to be like, heck on it, I miss those days where I just got in the shower and I just went, Psh, and I went. But at any rate, so that's all I wanted to come to you and talk to you all about. Um, if you have any questions for me, please leave them down below or even inbox me. I also welcome video responses. Um, so if, if you have any suggestions as well, you can leave them down below because I would love to hear from you guys. Miss you all. I hope everyone have, is having a great day and a great week. Look forward to that. Uh, hair regimen series I'm going to put up sometime this week and I will talk to you guys later. Love you. Bye-bye